Hello you guys, I'm the Diva and I'm Lilani and we are back with another haul slash we're gonna try it, she gonna try it on and uh, we'll give you our thoughts. Alright, so the first thing that we're gonna talk about is from a brand called Lemonhead and um, they are glitter that you put on your eyes. Um, I think you can put them other places too, but it's the lemon paste, which is eye safe, if I'm not mistaken. So when I found out that Beyonce's um, makeup artist used these two together on her, I was like, well, let me try to get the two of those. But then I then found out that they had a, a like a duo and um, these each cost. $22 but with the duo you got both for $36 the two that she used was um, Houdini highlight and dirty penny and uh, Leilani is going to demonstrate those for us today okay so this is the Houdini it's really weird oh yeah you can see it really good It is so pretty. Oh, yes. Blue is in there? It yes. Is, yes. But it's just white. It's white mm -hmm. and yellow. I guess that's why they call it Houdini. Houdini. Yeah. This one is um, Dirty Penny. Yeah. That is so pretty. This one, yeah. This one's just... Copper. Yeah, it just looks like a penny. Mm-hmm. Trying to get the light of it. But yeah. I'm going to put Houdini on my left eye. Wow. Okay, they say that you have to put it on and leave your eye closed until it um, sets. Let me see it. I'm gonna do me. I'm gonna do me while you do you. I'm just, I'm not trying to do a look. I'm just trying to put it on yeah. the eyelid so that y'all can see what it looks like on your eyelid. Yeah, about that. Look. I was like, okay, she's doing it fast. It's really... I could wear this to work. It's... <laughs> it's, a, it's a bit much, but I'm going to wear this to work. It's after it dries. They're going to be like, girl, where you going? <laughs> <laughs> to lunch. After it dries, it... It gets, like... Hard. Yeah. You can't do nothing. I tried to do it as highlight. You can't do nothing after it's dry because then it's just. Yeah. Oops. They say you can't even take it off with uh, a makeup wipe or nothing. You have to actually wash it off. Okay, let's do the next one as we learned from the first one. That yeah. little goes a long way. Okay, y'all, this so, is a hot mess. But go ahead. <laughs> what was you finna say? I didn't put too, I didn't put that much as I did for Houdini. It dried faster, didn't it? Yeah, it dried faster. <laughs> but I don't know if this is eyeshadow. It's not eyeshadow. It's just glitter that you put on top of your eyeshadow. Well, maybe that's why it doesn't look. You can put it on your face, like uh, for um, festivals and stuff yeah that's what that's what that's what this is for, yeah. and then they have one you can put in your hair but it's it's the gel kind it's not uh -huh. it's not this one i mean you probably could put this one in your hair if you wanted to you wanted to set some little sparkles in here no, you could that glitter is getting <laughs> lower and lower <laughs> like how did the glitter get down there <laughs> well i tried to do highlight right here <laughs> this is you can't really tell. <laughs> oh, the camera, you can't tell, but. What? Oh. My lights right there. Yeah. But this one shows a lot. This one's like very subtle. But still. Oh, I kind of, I like that one though. Glittery, yeah. Yeah, I like that one though. If you had nude and then you wanted to mm -hmm. throw some glitter on it. Yep. But by itself, see, it what, just looks mess. That's what I would do for this 
look right here. See that looks, yours looks nice. Yours looks really nice. You might as well just do the other side. It looks nice. Like you have, it's like yours. See, I can't even tell, but I look like a clown. <laughs> no, it's just that mine has purple eyeshadow. Yeah, right you have. That's all. That's the only thing. And see, yours don't look that bad. As bad as it could look. <laughs> as bad as it could look. Okay, so yours this should nice. be good for right now. Look at look at your face. You probably don't think it looks nice, but I think it looks. Oh wait, that's the wrong one. Sorry. Yeah, I think I it like looks it. nice. I mean, it could be. You cannot go out in broad daylight with this. I thought I was gonna be able to. No, you gotta be going to a festival. You gonna be looking like. You have to go to a festival. Okay, so the next uh, few items we're going to talk about are from the brand Dior. You guys, I have so much stuff from Dior, it is ridiculous. The uh, Dior Attic Lacquer Plump. And I have 456 Dior Pretty. So here is the packaging right here, you guys. You guys, look at this and look at the color. This is very beautiful. This is the color that I wanted to go on my lips, you guys. But let me show you what it turns into, okay? So she has a um, sample. a sample set. It's a set of three. And she's going to show you the one that I bought, which will be the first one that she does. Mm -hmm. And then um, there's two other ones that are in there. And... Um, she'll show you those as well. Okay, so let's see what hers looks like. I, you guys, when I first bought it, I bought a different one. I bought, let me see which one this one is. I bought Dior Glitz. And um, you're going to see why I took it back. She bought the one that looks like this. <laughs> you're going to see exactly why I took it back. Oh, the one thing the while she's putting it on, the one thing I wanted to let you guys know is that um, this is supposed to be a lip plumping product, but I don't feel like it plumps your lips. I feel like it goes on wet like a gloss and then the product itself plumps after a while of it being on. This is the worst demonstration ever. I swear to God. There's there's glitter everywhere. Okay. So, as you can see, it turned from this color right here to that color. You guys, I am going to keep this because it, it does turn out to be a pretty color on me. But, um, yeah, I just, mm, I just don't know. Like, let me try it on. Okay. So, yeah. There we go. Boom. This was not what I signed up for. Okay, but it's what I got. And it's just going to get deeper. Like the longer you wear it, the deeper it gets. So, um So yeah, when I went when I went the first time, I got a different color and I changed it for this one. I thought with it um I tried it on in the store and I was like, "Okay, this one it gets deeper but it's not that deep but it does it does make your lips tingle a little bit don't yeah, it? yeah when i first put it on it kind of tingles it kind of does tingle but at not first like, i was like at first i was like this doesn't tingle tingle so i don't know about the lip plumping but yeah it kind of does it's like a numbing tingle yeah it's, it's not even like a harsh tingle it's like constant numbness and the color that I'm trying on next is Dior Fever, and it's, the, I'm doing this color, and this color looks like the color I just put on. Now see how pretty that is going on? And look at my lips. Why are my lips dark brown? <laughs> Mine about to be dark. Look that at that. That nice. That's dark. <laughs> Mine are about to be. That's so what I said. The Black. the longer you have them on, the darker they get. This is Dior Pretty. You guys, I cannot with this. 
It looks good. I'm going to try to keep, I'm going to try to uh, keep using it and love it. But, mm, I won't be returning it. I just don't know that I'll be using it. That's sad. But I bought it so long ago. At least two, three weeks ago. So, I don't even have a receipt for it anymore. Okay. So, the last color is Dior Glitz. You see that? It looks metallic. It's not even like a coral. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's metallic. That's how I felt at work. <laughs> you went to work with this? Mm-hmm. It's like, it's getting dark. Yeah. It gets dark. And metallic. I'm so to help it, I can't. And look at my doodle brown lips. <laughs> <laughs> like, what? <laughs> what? I look like... I was at work looking like that. <laughs> that was horrible. Yeah. But it was an experience. And um, just so that you guys know, these lipsticks were $37. I went back in there and got a different lip. I bought another uh, lip lacquer, but this one is a Dior Addict Lacquer Stick. And I have two colors of this. And the girl told me these would not change. So I was like, okay, I can get this because whatever color it is, is the color it's gonna be. Okay, so um, I got LA, LA Pink 570. And the packaging looks like this, you guys. It's so pretty. And then the lipstick looks like this. That's a color that I would wear every day if I could. But yeah, that's that's a perfect color for me. Okay, I bought another lacquer stick and it is in Walk of Fame 874. And same packaging. This is what Dior Fever should have been. So those are the two that I bought, the two lacquer sticks that I bought. And like I said, those were $37 as well. And I, I know that I'll get a lot of use out of those because both of those are colors that I wear on a daily. I also bought a uh, Dior uh, Rouge lipstick and this is in Rendezvous number 683. It looks like this. It's my favorite color. <laughs> so here's that. It's just a nude color. So the next thing that I got is a Dior blush and it's in number 889. It is called New Red. It comes in the Dior packaging. The blush itself looks like this that's more true to color right there it's this color right here and it also comes with a little brush <laughs> what are we gonna do with this so um, yeah so that was that um, and the next thing that I bought is one of their limited edition eyeshadow palettes and again it comes in the uh, Dior velvet pouch and the packaging looks like this as well this is what it looks like you guys this looks very similar to the one that i got the uh palette that i got from chanel except this one to me honestly it's better it's so much better oh it is so beautiful too it is gorgeous yeah there it is it is gorgeous here are those swatches right there. Those are so beautiful. Yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna love this one. This is a keeper right here. Okay, we like this. That was everything that I got. These items that I just showed you all came from Dillard's. Crazy, but they did. They all came from Dillard's. 
not at the same time. All of them came, yeah, these, oh, besides the uh, Lemonhead, the rest came from Dillard's. I went to the Lemonhead um, website and purchased mine. Okay, they had their, they had that deal that where you could get the duo, the Beyonce duo. So, the B, they called it Beehive, I think, duo. So, uh, you could get the two of these for um, $32. And you can also order these from off of Beautylish, but um, I don't think on Beautylish they have to where you can um, get a duo. Because you can get this duo or I could have made my own. But I think I'm going to stop with these two. Okay, because I, I need the glitter to be a little bit more fine. Yeah. Like smaller for me to be able to wear them to work. I, like, I don't know where I'm wearing this. The house. I don't even think I'm keeping this. I think this is gonna go one to each child because I don't know that I can wear these. I'm kind of mad at myself, but I <laughs> I don't think that I will keep these just because the glitter is too much. Yeah. I can't wear this to work. I might as well just wear glitter. Mm -hmm. So she gonna pick one, and my oldest is gonna pick. Well, it's going to have one. It's going to have the other. Okay, you guys. So, that was the end of the video with us trying on stuff and reviewing how we felt about each product. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also, don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you receive all notifications when we post a video or when she posts her videos. So, bye, guys. Bye. Don't be like beside you.